Appalachian Wireless proudly brings you unlimited data. Unlimited data is only $80 a month for a single line. Four lines as low as $200. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. An East Kentucky network company. Data speeds slow to 25 gigabytes per line to 512 kilobits for phones and tablets and 15 gigabytes for modems. See store for more details. For the next month, University of Pikeville students as well as members of the community are invited to get to know U-Pike art professors through their work. Petra Carroll, Paula Smith, and Patricia Kowalik all say they are excited to have the opportunity to share their inspirations with the public. And you want to have people have an experience with the work and a conversation with the work that's, physical, that's uh, visual and physical. And then if they have questions, you can kind of take them through where you come as an artist. People look at this and might say, oh, that poor Appalachian child. Really, it's just the beauty of being in the mountains and having fun and running and playing. And, and it's that beautiful moment that you have when you're a childhood and you're free and there's sun and you're just out there. Patricia Kowalik, who is the chair of the university's Humanities Division, says all of the work she currently has on display comes from a single inspiration. Paintings that are responding to uh, the painting, um, the Nativity by the artist Della Francesca. So each one of them I've drawn inspiration for that. The art show will run through March 12th, but the public is invited to meet the artists at an upcoming event. So we have a reception on the 16th from 4 to 6 p.m. February. It's a Friday, kind of late afternoon, early evening, and I would absolutely love people to come in and, and talk to us about our art and ask us questions. Um, what is our inspiration or what is our process? The Weber Art Gallery is located on the second floor of the Record Memorial Building on the U-Pike campus. In Pikeville, I'm Shannon Deskins. EKB News.